I'm a It's a bad man What's up loves? Welcome back to the channel. Wicks to Wasteland here and of course back with another quick wig show and tell. And if you are interested in the unit, then definitely check out the information for Kenny Esther Wigs in the description box down below. So of course, big shout out to them for sending over the unit. So this wig is in the style Chi and this is a closure braided wig as you can see. The braids are crocheted onto a mesh dome cap. And of course, I have this in this beautiful color. This is the 1B30 mix. So as you can see, the unit comes with no combs, but there is an adjustable band or a spandex band, elastic band in the back of this cap. So here I'm just cutting off this lace for the closure really not too much to do with this wig as far as prepping or customizing the hairline this is a very full wig so i'm definitely glad that they included that elastic band and it also does come with baby hairs in the front you do have the option of customizing your braid your baby hairs so if you do want less baby hairs you can definitely specify that when you order now i did use some got to be gel and some freeze spray to secure this hairline to my hairline and it worked out really good however i really do not think that you need all of that you can definitely customize this wig with way less gel. So I did decide to keep the baby hairs a little long on this unit. Um, it just worked out pretty good. As you guys know, I feel like I have to say this almost every review. I'm not always team baby hair. Um, but definitely for this wig, it definitely looked a little bit more natural with longer baby hairs. Parting space on this unit is unbelievably natural. Even beyond the closure, I was really surprised at how natural the scalp looks on this wig. Now here you just see me adjusting this wig. My one big con with this wig is there is a little bit of bulk up top. So you may or may not want to remove some of those braids. Definitely not necessary. I do think this is a wig that looks better with an updo style versus something that's naturally down. And of course, just a quick brush with my fixed powder onto the parting space and voila baby here is the finished look for this wig of course you're not going to have any issues with shedding or tangling with this wig very detailed unit and very full so even with this being a crocheted wig this is definitely a lot of braids. You will not have to worry about any of those braids or the mesh cap peeking through, as you can see. Very comfortable cap on here. The elastic band definitely offers some added security with this wig. Overall, really pleased with this second unit by Kenny Esther. My only, like I said, issue is that that bulk up top of this wig, but it does appear that some of these braids may or may not be able to be removed. Do not quote me on that, boo boo, but you do have the option of exploring that and maybe removing just a couple of braids. So, if you guys are interested in this unit by Kenny Esther Wigs, then definitely give them a browse. 
all of their information for this wig and their website will be in the description box down below. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, of course. And drop me a comment down below. If you are not new, I see you, boo-boo. I see you, girl. <laughs> make sure you guys share the video, share the channel, share the love. And of course, I will always talk to you guys in the next one. Peace.